you know there will be unforeseen contingencies but you know what guess what hey beautiful people welcome back to my channel i hope you all are doing amazingly well if this is your first time of stopping here on this channel thank you so much i really appreciate you taking out your time to watch my video do not forget to please hit the like um, button also subscribe and turn on your bell icon just beside the subscribe button for my new and my returning subscribers you guys you know the real deal now you're you're so amazing thank you for your support i really appreciate it so let's get into the business of today i'm just going to make this video short and you know straight to the point 2020 we all know was a very challenging year it was so bad you know that all our mental health you know was actually affected it a lot of us you know had like some anxiety uh, uh, some anxiety attacks some panic attacks some of us into sunk, even sunk into depression at one point i mean given the situation of things happening in the world at the time so oh well still going on though you know <laughs> with the pandemic i mean not with the, like different deaths but with the pandemic but Anyway, 2020, according to the New York Times, it said that it was the worst year ever. Yes. And here in Canada, a poll was taken and 50% of people who answered that poll said that 2020 was the worst year ever. And trust me, guys, it was a very challenging year. I feel like it was a year of survival. You know, everybody just wanted to survive. Don't get me wrong. There were some few wins here and there. For example, the highlight of my 2020 was when I had my baby. Yes, that was my highlight. I had like one or two few wins here and there but my highlight was having my child now for other people their highlights could be you know changing jobs uh, buying properties um, actually visiting loved ones you know few people actually had their um, highlights as well but generally in the whole world it was a very challenging year but anyway 2021 2021 has been deemed by a lot of people as a year of hope not just by ordinary people like you and i but also by political leaders and religious leaders such as the pope you know and we are looking at 2021 with a lot of um hope with a lot of uh, uh aspiration and this is what i'm gonna ask you guys what is on your vision board for 2021 what do you hope to achieve in 2021 do you want to get a job? Do you want to have a baby? Do you want to lose weight? Do you actually want to gain weight? <laughs> yes, some people are actually looking to gain weight, you know. Um, do you want to just save money, have a particular amount of money in your bank account for 2021? Do you want to buy properties? Do you want to find love? Do you want to actually leave that relationship you're in? Do you want to relocate to um, another country? Do you want to visit other countries? What is on your vision board? Whatever is on your vision board, trust me guys, it's best to start now. We are in January. We still have a long way to go till December. So you still have a long way to achieve whatever you wanna achieve. Don't get me wrong, there'll be obstacles on the way, there'll be setbacks, you know, there'll be unforeseen contingencies, but you know what, guess what? Just keep trying, keep trying. If you're looking for a job, keep trying. You are gonna get a lot of no's, but trust me, you will definitely get that one yes. You're looking to have a baby, just keep trying. Do what you need to do and leave it in the hands of God. It will work out eventually. If you're actually looking to lose weight, look for the weight loss method that works for you and just start. Looking to gain weight, and be those of you that are looking to gain weight, no, I think we're enemies. <laughs> Because majority of us are looking to actually lose weight. <laughs> but anyway, if you're looking to gain weight, well, you know what to do. Um, you know, and all of that, you're looking to buy properties, start looking for uh, reliable estate agents, start saving up some money. Little drops of water actually makes a mighty ocean. So you guys, just start. Just start. Whatever you're doing, just start. Okay? I wish you the best of 2021. For me, uh, one of my goals on my vision board is to have 2,000 subscribers. I'm very realistic about my goals, you know, if I surpass it, all well and good, but I'm very realistic. And the only way I can achieve having 2,000 subscribers is for you to just 
watch this video and just subscribe just support me i'm a new t new youtuber like you know and i need all the support that i can get okay so that's it for this video guys thank you so much for watching do not forget to give this video a like hit the subscribe button and turn on your bell icon please very very important thank you for the support i really really appreciate it always know this you're amazing so do not let anyone tell you any different bye guys and i'll see you in my next video